what's going on guys back at you guys with another presentation um i'm gonna just talk real quick about something that i was thinking about um how's everybody doing on this saturday hope everybody's doing well on this beautiful saturday um can you believe it's november 2nd already Look how fast this year's gone by. 2025, here we come. Um, I got. I want to say for the record, um, try. I want to try to find a way to get it on. Uh, if anyone knows, you know how you can get. Um, even if you don't have. Even if you don't have. Um, a pr even if you don't have music for a song but if anyone knows how you can at least just get a song just the acapella version uh uploaded to uh spotify let me know how you can do that i don't have a producer yet for this new single that i just produced but um even back when i was a teenager i used to love writing songs and um i used to write rap songs when i was young but now I exclusive I exclusively only write R and B songs, and uh, if anyone knows how you can upload a, a, a acapella song to Spotify, let me know. I got a new single that I just wrote. Um, it's just a little small single. It's not a very long song, but the title of the song is called "Blast Off." You know, it's one of them R and B jams, and uh, I'm trying to find a way to upload the acapella version to Spotify. So if anyone knows how you can do that, just let me know. Um, and if you want to hear the song, check out Instagram. Um, if you want to hear the chorus, at least. But um, in this track, in this in this video here, in this presentation on this beautiful Saturday, I just want to talk about the three reasons to why I believe men get married. Three reasons to why I believe men get married is for intimacy, because men need intimacy. They need they need affection. They need they need sex. Another reason why men get married. Um, three reasons why I could see why a man would get married. Um, companionship. You know, no one wants to be lonely. Another reason why I say a man would get married. Finances. You know, that's one of the reasons to why my father always stressed marriage, because a significant other can help you financially. You see how expensive it is to live. Those are the three reasons to why I could see a man getting married. Any any other reason other than that? I couldn't see it. Um, what do you guys think about those three reasons? Do you think do you think those are three valid reasons to get married? Because I was just thinking to myself, uh, I feel those are three valid reasons to get married for for sex, for financial support and for companionship. I think those are three good, solid reasons to get married. Uh, what do you guys think? Because I believe that, you know, those are three good reasons to get married. I know they tell a lot of guys don't get married. You got a lot of guys, especially nowadays. They're um, they're opposed of marriage, but I, I feel those are three good reasons for a man to be married right there. So you can so you can get your needs met as a man, because as a man, intimacy, intimacy, that's one of the main things that you need, you know. And um, I've never truly been against marriage. I know there are guys out there who are against marriage. There are some guys who are opposed of being married. And I understand everyone has their belief system and their opinions, but I've never been totally against marriage because I feel like, you know, going through life, being single and, and lonely. I mean, is that really the ideal way that people truly want to live? No one wants to truly be alone, you know, but some people are alone for various reasons, sometimes that are out of their control. You know, uh, your appearance can cause you to end up being alone. So 
when 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 people talk about how they're happy and at peace being alone, I mean, you can do things to uplift yourself. You know, you can do things to make yourself feel somewhat good. But I don't think no one is going to truly be happy just being all alone all the time. No one's going to be happy being all alone. You need companionship, you know. You know, it, it, it's in human nature to want to be social and want to have connections with other people. Um, so, you know, I don't think no one can truly, truly be happy just being all alone. And anybody who says that they're truly happy just being all alone and they don't care about being alone for the rest of their life, I believe they're lying. Um, but... um. I know that marriage benefits the woman more so than the man. That's why my father always told me, you ever get married, make sure you sign a prenup. And if the woman is not down with you signing a prenup, effort. Because as a man, you don't want to have everything that you've gained and everything that you've built stripped away from you. You don't want to have that. So... You know, I feel like it's good. You know, I feel marriage can be good, you know, in a sense. But um, we all know that uh, marriage, you know, in marriages, you know, when they go south, it's always in favor of the woman, sadly. You know, when marriages go south, when they don't work out, when marriages fail, you know, it's never in favor of the man. You know, Um when marriages fail, when marriages end in, in divorce, you notice it's always the man's fault. It's never the woman's fault, sadly. But, um, you know, that's my, that's my thoughts on three reasons to why I could see a man getting married. Let me know what you guys think. Um, that's why I feel a man signing a prenup is good. Uh, even though in most cases, you know, the sad part is... You know, if, if your marriage doesn't work out, the courts, they going to order you break the woman off with something. But, um, you know, I just that's one thing I don't like about marriage. If, if, if someone was to ask me, what is one thing you dislike about marriage? The fact that it's in favor of the woman, that if the marriage doesn't work out, if it ends in divorce, the man is going to have to uh, pay the woman something. You know, even if she doesn't gain all of his assets, he's still going to have to pay something. And I feel that's one of the saddest parts about um, marriage is that it's always in favor of the woman. But I mean, unfortunately, that is the sad uh, sexist world that we live in, unfortunately. Uh, but um You guys let me know what you think about this topic. Um, do you think those three reasons that I mentioned are beneficial, you know, you know, to a man getting married? Because I think those two things are beneficial to a man getting married, in all honesty. You know, um, because, you know, there are certain things that can help you out. You know, you know, I mean... Marriage can help you out in some ways, but, um, that's pretty much been my, uh, talk on this for now. Um, you guys let me know what you think about this, you know, um, how you guys feel about marriage. Do you think those three reasons that I mentioned are valid? Or do you feel those three reasons that I mentioned are not valid at all? But um, you guys have a good one. And I'm going to say one last thing before I end this presentation. Now, if they legalize brothels, if they legalize escort services, then men wouldn't have to be married at all. That is why I feel like them legalizing brothels and escort services That'll be one of the best things they ever did. But um, on that note, you guys have a good Saturday. It does not feel like November. It does not feel like November. It's going to be a hot Thanksgiving. But you guys have a great day. Talk to you soon.
Peace.